Hey there folks, brace yourself for the most fantastic video I've ever created. I'm bursting with excitement to share this masterpiece with you. This project has been an absolute labor of love and I've poured my heart and soul into making it extra special. From the endless hours of meticulous editing to crafting a stunning coffee table, I've pushed my skills to the limit. I can't wait for you to see it because I believe it's going to blow your minds. But before we dive in, I just want to take a moment to express my heartfelt gratitude for all the love and support you've shown me. Reaching 1000 subs is a milestone I cherish and I'm incredibly thankful for every like, comment and subscription from each one of you. You're the reason I keep striving to bring my A-game. Now let's jump right into the magic of preparing the exquisite oak for this table. The process was time consuming, especially when I had to plane the lumber to perfection. But trust me, the effort was well worth it and it provided an excellent starting point for the project. Speaking of starting points, I had these two marvelous boards that I cut into several pieces and boy! The design element in the middle is nothing short of mesmerizing. Wait till you see it.
The legs are truly a work of art, crafted with passion and precision. I opted for the three pieces joined together with a meticulous handmade domino. To ensure flawless gluing, I ingeniously created templates out of MDF, including extra triangles to make the clamping process a breeze. Of course, no project is without its challenges. I may have hit a bump when routing the legs, leading to a couple of hiccups and the need for two extra leg parts. But hey, learning from these experiences is all part of the adventure. Now, let me confide in you a little mishap I had with the leg joints. I'll admit, I might have made a design no-no which could have been a problem with the larger table. But don't worry, I won't let it hold me back and I would love to hear your thoughts on this in the comments, starting with the magic word joint. Take a look at these clever triangles I incorporated. They make gluing the legs together a breeze using just four clamps. It's all about innovation, my friends. All about innovation. Ah, the trials and tribulations of crafting the tabletop. Those pesky pipe clamps curved the board and I had to flatten it again. But let me tell you, it's all part of the learning process and I'm better for it.
Speaking of learning, I even made a jig for cutting steep angles on the edges. And boy, did it work wonders. Though I must confess, it almost turned the shop into a fiery spectacle. Note to myself, get a new saw blade for the table saw. Sometimes I let my creative spirit take over, and that's when the magic happens. Admittedly, I might have gone a bit overboard with the roundovers on the legs, but it only led me to find a brilliant solution with the half lap joint. And you know what they say, sometimes the happy accidents become the best parts. Not so in this case. I might have faced a minor hiccup when trying to fix it, but hey, the gaps are closed and the rest of the process is smooth sailing. The final result is nothing short of spectacular and I can't wait to share it with all of you. So stay tuned for the grand reveal of this incredible coffee table project, packed with enthusiasm, love and a few heartwarming lessons learned along the way. Until then, keep that positive energy flowing and remember to hit that subscribe button to join me on my journey to 10k subs. Let's make it happen together.
for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. Definitely stay tuned for the next videos. Well, then, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.